All right guys, Rob French here at T1G again. What we're gonna discuss today, this agility drill, is the dice drill. So if you look at the number five on the piece of dice, uh, that's how the cones are set up. If you'll notice, you have, we have four cones around the perimeter and one cone in the middle. There's about a meter ring in the deck around the middle cone. How the cones are numbered is starting away and left. It's one, two, three, four, working in a clockwise direction. What you need is you need a, an RSO, a safety, or a coach, or a buddy, or someone to call out a number to you. You start at the middle cone. When he calls a number one, two, three, or four, you run to that cone, firing two hits on steel. Once you get your second hit, you come back to the center cone. Once you're within that one meter circle on that center cone, he's gonna call out another number. You're then going to run to that cone two hits and then you just keep going back to the middle cone after your second hit each time. If you guys watched the previous video where we shot on one foot, this kind of helps out here because if you're running to a position and you throw on the brakes when you get to that shooting position, all your weight is going to slide just like if you're in a skid in a car. Your weight transfer isn't going to be equal on both feet. So shooting on one foot, getting good at that helps us shooting on two feet when the majority of our weight is on one foot because we're throwing on the brakes when we get to a piece of cover. So you can see all these agility drills kind of help us out and become a better unconventional unorthodox shooter. So we're going to go ahead and get it on and get a little demonstration going. Two. All right, guys, what that was, that was the, the five drill on a piece of dice, That's because that's how the cones are set up. So what you saw was quick burst of speed, change of directions. There were even some not on purpose pivots, like you're running away from the target and you have to do a 180 degree pivot once you get to the cone, all while placing accurate shots at varying distances. So you could do this slick, you could do this full kit, you could do it for seven, eight, 12, 22 numbers. It's all just on your fitness level and what you, want to get accomplished that day. So throw that in your training toolbox and let us know what you think.